What's up everybody and internet? Um, I'm just making this video to try to stay connected and um, to encourage my other friends and WordPress community to make videos too. To just say hello and what you've been doing during this whole craziness. Um, quarantine and stuff with the virus. I've obviously been playing with makeup and trying to keep up with work in the best way that I can. Um, so even if you found this video and you're not from, you know, my WordPress peeps, um, totally make a video too and just express yourself because I think everything is just so crazy right now that it's important to try to keep connected and not go crazy. So I don't know, that's me trying to do that. Um, I don't, I'm an introvert, I suppose, and I've realized that even in my introvertedness, I still like being around people. So ever since the gym closed around here, I totally miss being in Zumba class and being in our little squad and everything. And it's not that I took it for granted. I might have to some extent, but... I just started, you know, getting into a pretty good workout routine and, you know, being more social in my exercise. So it's been particularly hard in that regard for me. And I think just the whole world's sort of going crazy and stuff. So as long as we can keep connected, it'll make things a lot easier, I think. So um, one thing that did kind of grate me just to share quickly, um, I did read, there's all kinds of misinformation and different opinions about different things, but one thing I read from a, I would say an acquaintance that's also a mental health professional, um, she was writing about how she wished that trauma was taken as seriously as this virus. And as a fellow mental health professional, yeah, absolutely, like, trauma should be taken seriously, but part of me was just so pissed off at, like, I don't know, using this virus to, to talk about that stuff. I mean, yes, mental health is so important, but at the same time, you know, if you're intubated in a hospital, you're not going to get the chance to work on your trauma. I'm sorry. Like, yes, trauma kills people, absolutely. It should be recognized, worked on, and all of that, but I don't know. I just, this should be the focus for now, because if we don't, then, you know, there's not going to, some people aren't going to have a chance to work on their mental health if they literally can't, they can't breathe and they, you know, this virus takes them. So, I don't know. Share some of your frustrations if you want to make a video or, or blog post or don't. I think that for me... I've been on WordPress for a little while, and it's always really interesting to see pictures or videos of the people behind the words because you feel like you know them, but it's not necessarily as visual a platform as YouTube. So, um, yeah, I think it's important to try to stay connected, go about life as usual as you can. If you're in a place where you can actually go on walks and, you know, that's allowed, that's what I've been doing while maintaining, you know, social distancing and all of that. So I've been trying to work out, trying to, you know, not just sit around and eat, even though for the first few days of quarantine, that's what I did. <laughs> but um, I'm going to try to keep with it. So maybe I'll make some more videos, maybe not. But I just wanted to say hello to everyone. I hope you're all well as well as you can be, I guess, through all of this. So, yeah, say hello. Make a video if you feel like it. Um, take care, wash your hands, and be safe.